Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we've got a topic that's probably crossed your mind at some point. What happens when you accidentally wash your precious AirPods? We know, it's a sinking feeling that most of us would rather avoid. But fear not, because we're here to guide you through the steps to take if you ever find yourself in this unfortunate situation. So, let's dive in. What are the risks associated with AirPods getting washed? We know how much you love your AirPods, but the truth is, they're not waterproof. Even the water-resistant models like the AirPods Pro and the third-generation ones aren't built to handle full-on water submersion. Here are some of the risks you face if your AirPods take an accidental swim in the washing machine. Circuitry damage. The delicate electronic circuitry inside your AirPods and their charging case can be seriously harmed by even a small amount of water. Minerals and salts in the water can conduct electricity and cause short circuits, potentially leading to long-term issues. Rapid battery drainage slash failure. The lithium-ion batteries in your AirPods are not water-friendly. Water exposure can lead to quick battery drainage, leakage, and even overheating. Poor sound quality. Water can mess with your AirPods speakers, resulting in distorted sound quality and even physical damage to the diaphragms. This can affect both sound and microphone performance. Connection issues. Bluetooth connectivity can take a hit, causing disconnections, audio dropouts, and reduced range. What to do if your AirPods got washed? Now, if you ever find yourself in the unfortunate situation of realizing you've washed your AirPods, don't panic. Follow these steps to give your AirPods a fighting chance. Remove them immediately. The longer they're exposed to water, the worse the damage can be. If they're in their charging case, take them out to prevent potential short circuits. Dry them first. Before testing anything, make sure your AirPods are completely dry. Use a soft cloth and avoid hair dryers, as they can do more harm than good. If your AirPods were submerged for a longer period, leave them to dry on a table overnight or place them in a jar containing silica gel packs or rice for about 24 to 48 hours. Test functionality. Once they're dry, check for audio distortion, battery drainage, and connectivity issues. And hey, remember, don't rush this step. Reach out for help. If things still aren't looking up, don't hesitate to contact Apple support. And if you've got Apple Care Plus, you might be able to get your AirPods fixed or replaced for a small fee. How to test if your AirPods are still working after being washed. So, you've dried your AirPods and taken all the precautions. But how do you make sure they're really back in business? Here's what to do. Check audio quality. Connect your AirPods and play your favorite tunes. Listen for any changes in audio quality, like distortion or muffling. Test automatic ear detection, put your AirPods in and play something. Remove one, and the audio should pause. If not, there might be an issue. Monitor battery life, charge your AirPods and watch out for any battery issues. If they're draining too quickly, that's a red flag. Assess connectivity, pair your AirPods with different devices to test Bluetooth connectivity, range, and speed. Test microphone, record a voice memo or make a call to check for microphone issues like distortion or distant sound. Try physical controls, depending on your AirPods model, test their controls, whether it's tapping or pressing on the stems. And there you have it, folks. Accidentally washing your AirPods might feel like a disaster, but with the right steps, you can still salvage them. Remember, patience is key. Give your AirPods the time they need to dry properly before putting them to the test. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow AirPods lovers. Until next time, stay tuned, stay curious, and keep those AirPods safe.